guys, welcome back to my channel today. In today's video, we're going to be doing another eyeshadow palette review. There are so many hot new releases right now for eyeshadows. I'm super surprised, actually. <laughs> Anyways, the one we're going to be talking about today is by Dominique Cosmetics. This is the Lemonade palette. I also picked up one of her lip glosses. This one is in the shade Peach Tea, and we'll be talking about this one as well. Really quick, if you guys are new, hello, my name is Jenna. Thanks so much for tuning in and checking out this video today. I really, really appreciate appreciate it. In this video, I will let you know my first impressions on the product. I'll show you the swatches of all the shades, of course, and the lip gloss, and I will let you know if I think it is worth your money. Before we get started, I do know that Dominique Cosmetics is created and owned by Kristen Dominique. I know that she is a content creator here on YouTube. I have seen a few of her videos and I do enjoy them. I am a little bit worried to share my thoughts on this palette because it is not all positive and I know there are a lot of supporters for Kristen out there. So I just wanted to give a little bit of a disclaimer. This is not meant to drag her in any way. I'm just trying to let you know my honest opinion regardless who created it. Even if I love the creator or I don't, it doesn't matter. I'm just trying to review the product as is and just let you know my genuine thoughts. With all of that said now, let's get on to the video. The outer packaging of this, you guys, so stunning. It really did surprise me. I do love how it's a beautiful, like gold shimmery packaging. I love the color scheme of this, super gorgeous. When you open up the palette, you will see a nice mirror that's amazing. Then you will also see the 10 eyeshadows themselves. Here are the swatches of the shades. The first row from left to right is Lemon Soda, Pink Lemonade, New Tea, Peach, and Cucumber. And the second row from left to right is Mango, Peach Tea, Chai Tea, Strawberry, and Blueberry Fizz. In this palette, there are a mix of mattes and shimmers, and it does retail for 42 American dollars on the Dominique Cosmetics website. First of all, when I was applying the mattes to the skin, I really, really enjoyed them. They're a touch dry compared to other formulas I have played with, but they are still really, really creamy. They blend really nicely as well, so I'm very, very impressed with those. The shimmers, on the other hand, really vary for me in quality. You can absolutely see the shimmer particles in these pans. It's not going to be a really light, fine shimmer. It's definitely noticeable and much more prominent on the eye so just keep that in mind there are a few of the shimmers that actually work really really well and when applied to the eye they blend really nicely the fallout is very minimal so that I really appreciate when it comes to shades I'm talking about the first one is peach this one is really really beautiful very pigmented and very minimal fallout blueberry fizz as well is really nice when swatched it's very consistent I haven't applied this to the eye yet but it does seem like it will blend out beautifully just like the peach formula the cucumber one is a little bit less pigmented, definitely heavier on the shimmer. This one is not bad though, so this one I would say is kind of in the medium. The shimmers that really disappointed me though were the pinks. The strawberry is incredibly light, so just keep that in mind. Very, very shimmer based as well. I did have to build that one up a lot on the eye just to get the look I'm wearing today. And the pink lemonade shade right over here is really, really dry for me. It doesn't swatch at all on my arm, nor does it apply to the lid at all. It feels like it's dried out. So maybe I'm going to assume this is a bad palette perhaps when I was thinking about purchasing this guys and reviewing it The pinks were the ones that kind of drew me in and then the pops of color were just a nice touch So the fact that the pinks don't really work is really really disappointing Even though the mattes are super nice The majority of the shades here are the shimmer shades and because they are really really variable inconsistent I just can't recommend this palette to you guys That is just my honest opinion and to take it further I would even consider returning this but because they don't have a return policy it says all sales are final on their website. I actually feel kind of gypped because I can't even return it. So unfortunately, this one is going to be a pass for me. Now let's talk about the Lemonade Lip Gloss. The one that I picked up is in Peach Tea. The outer packaging is really beautiful. I do love the pink kind of theme that goes with this and the gold font on the package. All the lip glosses are available on DominiCosmetics.com and they retail for 17 American dollars each. The fact that you can see the color of this product through the packaging is really, really nice. So I definitely appreciate that. However, as I'm holding this in my hand, I can tell this is a pretty cheap plastic that it's made out of. The formula itself is incredibly sticky and that's something that you either like or you don't like. So if you don't like sticky lip glosses, you will definitely not like this one. I do find that as I was wearing it throughout the day, I did find that it kind of warmed up a little bit as I was talking and kind of moving my lips together. It warmed up a little bit to the point where the stickiness kind of reduced, but it was still there. This is a sheer lip gloss as well. There's not a lot of pigment to it, but 
that's okay because they don't claim to be a highly pigmented gloss. Honestly, it does make the lips look nice and shiny, I'll give it that, but because of the packaging is kind of a pass for me, the fact that it's really, really sticky is also a pass for me. I do have better lip glosses in my collection and I know I won't be reaching for this at all, so this is a little bit disappointing as well. Anyways, guys, those are my first impressions on the Lemonade palette from Dominique Cosmetics as well as the lip gloss from Dominique Cosmetics. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did, let me know by giving it a big thumbs up as well as don't forget to subscribe on your way out. I would love to see you guys back here and until my next video, take care. Thanks so much for watching. Bye!